Hello, everyone, and welcome. Happy Wednesday. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Hello, everyone, and welcome once again. Happy Wednesday, everyone. Ho, ho. Mm, <laughs> let us gather around the fire Ooh. and tell spooky stories. <laughs> yes. And play the park. And play the park. Um, so, yes. Oh, uh, that's very bright. That's really bright. So, uh, welcome, everyone. For those of you tuning in for the first time, uh, this is the Wednesday community stream here uh, live out of Durham, North Carolina, uh, in our USA studio. My name is Andy. I'm Nicole. And we're community managers for Funcom. Um, if you are a returning viewer, I see some familiar faces already in chat. It's good to see you. Thanks for coming in. Uh, typically what we do on Wednesdays is play a game that was developed here in North Carolina. Not always. Uh, in this case, today we're going to be playing The Park, which is our first, uh, first actually our first uh, psychological horror game, like mm -hmm. our first, our, our first like first person horror game. Also our first game ever done in Unreal. Uh, this is yeah. actually, it originally came out of, uh, or it, it was originally released as sort of like a test bed on using the Unreal Engine, and then we would later catapult off that knowledge to go on and create Conan Exiles, <laughs> 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 which is a pretty big jump, which is awesome, yeah, actually. Yeah, yeah. Um, and of course, Exiles has been a pretty, pretty big hit, so mm -hmm. obviously, obviously the test worked. It worked, <laughs> I'd say. Um, but yeah, so like kind of in the spirit of Halloween times, uh, we're going to be playing some spooky titles, uh, including our own games, The Park. We might be playing some other stuff too uh, later this week or next week that aren't just our games. Mm -hmm. um, I scare very easily. Scare so very like, easily, Yeah, yes. but I've played The Park before, so I know... I don't know where the scares are. I already forget. It's been a while since I've played. It's been so, a really long time yeah. for me too. So this will be a somewhat fresh experience mm -hmm. for me. Um, hopefully, hopefully, people in chat that haven't played it in a while will share can share kind of a similar fresh experience for us. Uh, this probably won't be able to be. We probably won't be able to finish this in one playthrough. Mm -hmm. uh, definitely two though, because I know it's not the longest game. But should be able to get through if we wanted to play it next Wednesday. We might be yeah. able to get through it. Um, uh, catching up on chat a little bit too, first of all. So, uh, Dart Akuma says Nicole's very adorable. Oh yeah, this is my, uh, so you probably saw at the very beginning the, the Spinosaur, or the Dinosaur Chibi, and my username is Spinosaur, the Dinosaur, it me. So like I have to, it's Halloween, so I had to dress up a little bit. Um, uh, hi, fro hello from Germany. Well, hello, Aus North Carolina. <laughs> hello. Um, yeah, so... Uh, Welcome to the stream, Vagnar the Viking. Uh, yeah, I remember you from the uh, Excel stream Thursday, I believe. So I think you were there. Um, and then, uh, of course, the chosen one uh, is correctly ascertaining a rumor. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> not it's quite out a rumor there. anymore. Anymore, yeah. yeah so um, we're also playing the park not only because it's spooky times, but also because the park is going to be arriving on the Nintendo Switch on yep. October twenty second, mm -hmm. uh, which is next Tuesday. That's soon, yeah. <laughs> it's, yeah. <laughs> uh, which also happens to be the release date of our other first-person horror game that's going to be coming yeah. up. Um, Moons of Madness launches next Tuesday. Oh, boy. Uh, we're all really excited about that. So, yeah, kind of like a lead-up to that. Uh, we're going to be playing some games, too. Uh, and then I think we'll definitely be, pl be playing Moons of Madness either on or around Ooh, launch day as well. So yeah. that'll be a lot of fun, yeah. Uh, hello from Puerto Rico. That is so cool. I've never been to Puerto Rico. I always wanted to. Seems like a very nice place to be. I have never been. I would yeah. like to one day. It's really, I, like, that's one of my favorite things is, like, seeing where people are tuning in from. Like, because it's really just all over the world. Some A lot of our viewers, like, yeah, from Germany. It kind of gives you a little bit of perspective, too, of just, like, yeah. what your reach can be as, like, someone who works in this position. Yeah, it's yeah, like, yeah. Uh, we are reaching out to people all across the globe and... People are tuning in and watching every movement <laughs> and judging. No, I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> it's really cool to to learn, you know, and know that people from around the world are watching you. I think, and uh, you know, thank you so much for tuning in. We yeah, really, yeah. really appreciate it. Uh, are you going to moon us madly, Andy? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> That's probably just uh, banned from streaming. First of all, yeah, that would get the company banned from Twitch for sure. Yeah, and probably uh, YouTube and, and probably Mixer. everything. Yes, and <laughs> correct, correct. <laughs> Uh, and then Taco, yeah, you uh, need to not sleep and play two games in one day. Yes. Mm -hmm. Why not? I mean, I mean as long yeah. as you do it healthily. 
Because he can be, I mean, it's not, not sleeping equals healthy. I mean, I don't get any sleep, but I'm reasonably healthy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I died. I actually did get a little bit sick over the weekend. I was running a pretty gnarly fever. Something like uh, my highest was 101.5 Fahrenheit, which oh, is not no. great. Not uh, a great look. It was not a cute look, guys. The the Georgie nerd says, I'm playing tons of horror on my channel. I'd love to add your new game to that list. Excited. Well, that's awesome. Make sure you play with the lights off and headphones on. Yeah, you can play the park. I mean, the park is I, available now. I think now. they mean moons. Oh, they mean moons? I think they mean moons, yeah. Okay. Yeah. The I mean, new game, they say. Because the park's been out for a while. The park's been out for a while. Yeah. It's available now on Steam um, and on consoles. And we'll be coming to the Switch on the 22nd. And then Moons will be coming out on the 22nd on PC. Mm-hmm. And then we'll be coming out on PS4 and Xbox One on the 21st of January. Yeah. I've heard rumors of the sleep thing. <laughs> Who needs it? Sleep when you're hey, dead, right? Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. It's fine. Um, All right. So I guess we're supposed to put... So we, we've dimmed the room a little bit. We Is tried better? adding some spooky atmosphere. Some spooky atmosphere. I've forgotten this... the Halloween decorations once more, but I'm hoping to do yes, that Yes, but this... I think hopefully this gets the effect. Yeah. That you might be looking for. Uh, if only you knew how ridiculous the setup is that's going on right now to get this light here. We won't tell you, but it's ridiculous. Uh, <laughs> we'll take a picture some point. To we'll, we'll take a behind the yeah, scenes exactly. thing after Halloween just to sh- and yeah, show, exactly. show you guys just how janky this is. Dumb. <laughs> All right. <laughs> because we love it. Anyway, we're gonna play the park. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna swap over in a little, just right here. Oh. Let's see. Why is that not showing? That's embarrassing. One sec. Oh, you're fine. Um, yeah, the oh, park, there it is. The park can be super creepy. It's, um, yay. Uh, there are, like, a couple of jump scares, if I recall. But there are. But it's not, like, um, ooh. Yeah, sorry. That was a little bit loud. Uh, yeah, let us know how the audio is and the music yeah if you can still if, if you can still hear us over the music yeah if you can still hear us over the music uh we'll we'll try our best not to talk over the cutscenes. right uh when there's spoken parts and then are we'll you just sure go you don't want to mute it and then we can voice over the oh god <laughs> that actually reminds me a lot of an old stream that i did with joel and roman really back in the day when they played the park and joel read every single note out loud dramatically oh that's great all right <laughs> that was a very long stream <laughs> uh, do you plan to add other languages to the park? Uh, I don't know. That is a great question. I oh yeah. Let me get back I, to you on yeah, that. Let me. Say, we'll like, ask. I'm more than welcome. Or more I, than welcome. I'm more than happy to ask. Yeah, I I have an answer in my head that I'm inkling towards because I thought I heard something about that, but I don't want to say anything I was on stream. Say no promises. Yeah, I don't want yeah. to say I don't want to say something wrong on stream by accident. So let me just make sure first. Have you got subtitles on? Yes. So just to be sure. Yeah, I got subtitles on. Oh, and for you guys, for whatever reason, you guys might see that the cursor is a little bit like off. Oh. It should show, still shows full screen on. It's it still shows properly, I think. Yeah. But the cursor is going to be just a little bit off, so I apologize in advance for that. Oh man. Okay. So. Uh, uh... Is it Taco TCO or is it Taco? Oh, we call him Ta- Ta- uh, TCO. Is a OG like gangsta from TSW days oh, that I've known gotcha. for a really long time. Yeah, so we just call him Taco. But yeah, okay, that's great. Uh, they still remember the rating. <laughs> yeah, that was a while ago. That was like when I first started as community. I was gonna say I wasn't there when uh, you. I-, I think it was a year. I came after a year when you started community. So in my heart and mind. I always return to Atlantic Island Park. Oh. Mm. Disney World's like that for me. It's a small oh. world after all. Where's Mr. Bear? Where's Mr. Bear? Bear? Oh my god. <laughs> Callum! Stay in the car. Go and ask information. You know kids never do what they're told. Of course not. Stay in the car. Stay in the car. Pick up the can. <laughs> Pick up the can. Pick up the can. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so I'm gonna I'm gonna endure something just for y'all. Uh, my mouse, my y-axis is not inverted. 
It's something that every time that we play, if we ever have to switch seats, like I immediately have to switch back to to changing that off. I don't know how you do that. Like, how do you learn to switch it to the Y axis? Like, is that something like one day you're just like, oh, what's this? Oh, wow, I'm weird. It's how I, like I learned. This. It's how I learned how to play games. Like my, the first times I played, a, like the first games I played were like um, games like Descent and like. Um, flight simulators oh so i guess okay. i just kind of learned how to play as an I airplane guess, yeah what? Oh, man what was in that coffee i know lorraine lorraine <laughs> don't blame yourself lorraine people lose things all the time take a deep breath Think about the last place you saw your son's teddy bear. Hey, stop! I think your boy just ran into the park. I'll unlock the gates for you. Thanks, buddy. It's true. Losing losing my kid's teddy bear does, unfortunately, cause dissociative episodes. <laughs> I told you to wait in the car. Over here. Where is he? Callum, where are you? For mommy, Callum. Oh, hmm. Seem to have lost control with my character. Hmm. It's fine. <laughs> Figure something out. Hmm. <laughs> this is a problem. <laughs> okay. Of course, doing a fresh blind playthrough. Uh. Uh, oh boy. Okay. So I can't move my mouse. I can't actually move my character. You hit escape and then go back. We'll try and see if that works. There, there we go. go. Okay. You I don't know why that didn't work. That was weird. On this side. Um. The apathy of our everyday lives. Oh, sorry. Lies. I'll wait. And on the other, anything we might dare to dream. It's no wonder Callum ran back inside. I wouldn't want to leave either. Attention, employee. The park. Uh. Have a Interesting physics to make the. Oh man, I'm trying to think back Ooh. to the. Uh... Uh, I'm trying to think back to when Joel was around, mm -hmm. so we could talk more at length about how a lot of these things are created. Because I don't, I don't have a lot of that dev, like that arcane dev lore. Dude, I would love behind the scenes look of the park, being able to like, like. Uh... Like, uh, director's no, no commentary. Clip and, like, yeah, yeah. You know, oh, see how yeah. They do stuff. Like, I love that stuff. The park. How long was I on that I escalator? Um, I know, that was the longest escalator ride in, world, in the world. Okay, uh, Monte Bullard uh, he says, if you guys want to come to a haunted house and come next, I'll let me know. I built one. Pictures, oh, nice. please! I want to see that. Come That's awesome. Um, try, definitely message me some, some screenshots, either on Twitter or forums or whatever. Uh, somebody get that shot on a leash. So yeah, that's a good point. Come Just back. put him on a leash. Tot totally could have all been averted. I know, dang it. Annabelle, yeah. Hardcore no mouse. Off. And oh, glowing yeah. sneakers. I it's... know, don't all kids have glowing sneakers these days? Yeah, where's the Skechers? Where's the bogeyman? You can... Is he? You can kind of see him. Or was it just for a little... Oh yeah, because he does show up every now and then. You can kind of see he? him just like... That little like bobbly thing on the very top of the. Is that him? Are you sure it's not just a treetop? Might be just the treetop. I don't he know. He might have been there just the for a Oh yeah, he already went poof. Oh, yeah. he already went poof. Yeah, oh, yeah, never yeah. Mind. So yeah, he's so around. So it was just the treetop. My bad. Um. I, I forget a lot of the old details on this because it's been a very long time. Uh, uh, Monte, there are ways you can take screenshots on um on Xbox. You won't be able to send it through Mixer, but um. But if you want to send me the screenshots through like my email address, that's fine too. Examine shoe. I think this belongs to Pick up that shoe. <laughs> wow! <laughs> Memorize every detail of the shoe. <laughs> Who could that be? Chad the chipmunk, huh? Just a drunk guy in a suit. <laughs> so say we all. Chad the chipmunk, worse in class. Chad can't even seem to pass. Chad gets angry, he likes to fight. Chad is beaten every night. Oh, Chad will have a dead end job. Chad will die a useless slob. Damn. Hmm. Can you just commentate everything now, Nicole? <laughs> can't do it in an Australian accent, unfortunately. <laughs> can't be Joel, unfortunately. Right. Purchased land on Solomon Island. Are for you a also going to be reading every single note? God, I shouldn't. 
Purchase I mean, like, the land on Solomon Island for a pittance. For a pittance. My, I might add whatever old Archie Henderson did. Okay, I'm good. <laughs> it's gonna take a while. Yeah, I so, don't wanna. I don't know, Chad. Should I read? Every, just, uh, should, should we read yeah, every single one? Up, just like, just like, yeah, 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 whatever. Trash can. <laughs> Atlantic Island Park. The name is perfect. I cannot imagine it being anything else. This is the start of something amazing. Uh, Monte, if you want the directions on how to screenshot um, on Conan Excels on Xbox, like uh, DM me. Like I said, I can give you those directions. Um, Georgie the nerds or the the Jordy nerd says, not gonna lie. During my playthrough, I was convinced the kid was called ha Harry. <laughs> Harry. Harry, Harry, come here. <laughs> On Nicole's dark side of showing, yeah. Um, TCO, yeah, I think the... I'm going to call you something different every single time I address you, Taco, so... Callum, stay where you are! My dark side, where yeah, yeah. I, I'm like, um... I, uh, I, Gretzko or whatever. Like, I do metal singing at night. Oh, yeah, she goes to karaoke when she's frustrated yeah. and starts belting out some death metal. Mm-hmm. Um, yes, yeah, so I don't know if that's a reference. I can't confirm nor deny the reference there, but I, the, the park has gone through multiple different iterations of names from what I understand and actually is the reason why we have a new internal like project name <laughs> system because people got way too attached to its original name, which I think was just simply called Atlantic Island Park. And I believe one of the names that was proposed for the park was called Callum, Where Are You? Oh, that's right. Yeah, I think that was one of the names that got uh, proposed for the park originally before the park got settled on. That's right. Uh, that's what I heard anyway. Well, uh, that's right. The law had reminded me that. A boy named Hansel. Oh, I'll wait. And a girl named Gretel. They were very poor and had very little to bite or sup. <laughs> sup. So. <laughs> What will become of us? The woodcutter asked his wife one night. I tell you what, husband. We will take the children into the thickest part of the forest tomorrow and abandon them there. No, my wife. I cannot do that, said the man. Then we will all four starve, you fool. Hansel and Gretel overheard their parents talking and Gretel began to weep. Do not fret, Gretel. Hansel said. He crept out of the hut and gathered white stones from the ground to fill his pockets. The next morning, the woodcutter leads the children into the... Hmm? <gasps> sorry. What am I... I'm not going to know the ending of this! Oh god, I'm sorry. <laughs> ...slice of bread and warns them that they will get no more food that day. So can you guess what part of the game was QA's absolute favorite? This is a new the unskippable swan ride scene? Perish the thought. Yep. Das ist eine deutsche Geschichte. Did I say that right? I think so. It's a German story. The children are sent to bed without any supper. No supper! No supper! You can't eat your meat. Wait, you can't? Wait, hold on. <laughs> if you don't eat your meat, you can't have any pudding. That's... Sorry, that took me too many times to, to get right. <laughs> In the morning, their mother gave them a slice of bread and led them deep into the forest once again. Hansel broke his bread into pieces and left a trail of breadcrumbs to lead them safely home. But hungry-eyed birds... Uh, waffle on crack. Age of Conan does still have, uh, have active servers. Abandoned by their parents and unable to find the trail home, <laughs> the children wandered in the forest for three days. See, children are just stupid. Getting lost in forests. I know. Who does that? The children stumbled into a clearing with an exceedingly strange house. A strange its walls house. were made of gingerbread, and its windows Do you were like made of, of clear sugar. sugar. Hansel, desperate, okay, ran forward and 
I began to nibble on the walls. I'm looking for the... There we go. <laughs> nibble, nibble, little mouse. Who is nibbling Ooh. at my house? I forget who the narrator was for this. Was this Simon Poole? No. Oh, that's a good question. The sound director? I bet it was. I honestly don't know. It is really good. and Gretel stayed back, for the old woman reminded them of their cruel mother. Come, children, don't be afraid. I have oh, it is Simon Poole, yeah. So Simon Poole's the art, uh, sorry, the audio director, and he has done a lot of the audio and the music for various fun con games, including, I believe, a lot of the Secret World soundtrack. Oh, really? Yeah. Nick Andy, Brand a British dude! Where have you been? Wish it could have been Tim. Yes, Tim Curry! That would have been amazing. Spice! <laughs> that actually surprised me. <laughs> Yay, tea for everyone. Thank you, Melcom. Don't you mean Donka? Dankeschön! Dankeschön! Oh, Random Bursty to play the part. Great. That's awesome. Once he is fattened up, I shall Everything needs to be narrated by Tim Curry. You're damn right. Everybody should look up Tim Curry's best role, which was Satan in... Uh, uh, wait, what's his face's name? Uh, Tom Cruise's Today, first movie. Hold on, I've already lost it. Hold on. He, Tim Curry Climb literally plays Satan. And light the oven. But Gretel pretended not to understand. Uh, Legend. It was a 1985 how. film. Where is the opening? Hold on, I've I'll never seen you. it. Fool! The old witch said. The opening is Fool! Here. And she moved to show Gretel. Seizing her Look. courage. Brave Gretel oh wow! Yeah, that's a great Satan. He's got the biggest horns. Into the oven. Hot. Reminds me of the um, the horny the horned Reaper from Dungeon Keeper. Gretel freed her brother Hansel, and together he was darkness, not Satan. Same thing, right? <laughs> Close enough. I mean, yeah. Google Legend Tim Gurry, and you'll see like amazing. I had no idea it was him for the longest time. Yeah, it was, uh, I think, then, I think, uh, Tom Cruise was 18 or something like that in that film. They divided up the body of the old witch and ate her. Hmm. So the children, uh, are That was dark. It's a good turn that escalated quickly, yes. All then. right. Is that canonical? Is that actually what happens in the original story? Uh, I don't remember. Did they eat the witch? Uh. Oh. <laughs> Did you have a fun time? <laughs> I sure did. You're cordially required to enjoy ride. yourself. I've heard this story thousands of times. Help me. <laughs> this is actually a <laughs> representative of her QA staff. <laughs> <laughs> I've had to listen to this thousands yeah, of exactly. times. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that doesn't happen. I know the witch gets pushed story. into the oven, but I I don't remember the part where the kids eat the witch. Right. Yeah, I thought they ran away, yeah. Well, all right, achievement unlocked. That reminds like the the um the really dark German Hansel like and Gretel. Oh. I used to read it to Callum when the electricity was shut off. Those poor children. The whole world against them. The forest, the birds, the old witch, even their own parents. I used to imagine that Callum and I were the kids in that story. Not mother and son, but brother and sister, hand in hand against the unkind world. We were always hungry, looking for our own house made of candy, looking for the sweetness that could take the pain away. Hunger leads people to desperate, terrible places where the tree branches reach like claws. Cool. Stay where you are! Um, so, that's right, it was Frida. Frida Ryder? Was that her name? Yeah, she did this, and then her next biggest role was playing 
the main character in Mass Effect Andromeda. Stay where you are. Oh, nice. Um. So am I going the right way? I can't remember. There's like there's a there's a children's book in Germany. Melcom, I know what I'm talking about, but it's mm -hmm. supposed to scare. Oh, the chipmunk's gone. Where where is he? Um, there's a, a German children's book that's supposed to scare kids into like cutting their nails and like make sure you eat what's on your plate or like things like that. And it's called um, Struve Peter. So Come like apparently right it's now. like shock headed Peter or whatever. Like this is the. Uh, the, the oh wow. The, yeah, so it's from like the 1917, 1917, something like that. But yeah, it, oh, other it way. Was a scary okay, book. sorry, I'm going the wrong way. Jeez. Uh, yeah. Um, was it Jimmy said that you know the kids eat Baba Yaga in the text adventure game in Secret World? A lot of those folk tales are kind of like shared across cultures and languages. They are. Right? Oh, Bumble, you've heard of that book too. Yeah, I want to say that it was uh probably translated to English too. But it was a, it was scary. I didn't like that book. It was like these are the bad things that will happen to you if you don't do things oh, right. children this should. Went, uh, my bad. Oh, you're fine. It's been a while. If you look down, do you see your feet? Nice. <laughs> I'll never forget. Uh, what was it like? It was one of those Jurassic Park games where you had to like. It was. It was really. It was really bad, but also really good in a lot of ways. It was groundbreaking in some strange ways in terms of like how it presented itself, although it wasn't a very like it, it was considered a kind of a Another mediocre accident. game. Which this game? Place? I forget. It was like Trespasser or something like that. And you had like in order to look at your health, you had a, you had a tattoo oh. on your chest, and so you had to look down and see how many like how filled it was. Trespasser. Was it Trespasser? Says Bumble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was Trespasser. I'm gonna look it up now. Oh god. Oh. It's the bear! Yay! Despite constant interruptions to work, Atlantic Island Park will be opening on time. Governor is booked to cut the ribbon. Oh. So the only question is whether we will have any customers. So, like, I was wondering why I never played this, because I played literally every single dino, dino game out there. Except I didn't like the ones where you shot or hurt the dinosaurs. Because oh. I didn't like that. But they, they hurt you if you don't shoot or hurt them. Yeah, but I didn't like... I thought... I thought dinosaur games with guns was like most like the dumbest thing uh, as a kid. Interesting. But I guess they could be fun. I just played a lot of Operation Genesis. Um, they had amazing physics and the way the game lets you control your arms to interact with things, but it was basically a tech demo because it didn't work so well. That's Aww. right. That's right. I remember that. Yeah. So I remember there, it did a lot of things amazingly, but not amazingly well. Yeah. <laughs> if that makes sense. Uh, yeah. Oh, that's right. Uh, so Shruva Peter first came out in 1844. So no, no wonder it was so dark. They uh, they taught kids by scaring them. Mm -hmm. back then. I guess sometimes you still do. Oh yeah, I got I got. I was taught to be scared of things when I was little. Better better wash your body right. I'll dump this toaster into the bathtub. Wow. I'm probably not that. <laughs> probably not that. Sorry. I got really dark. I'm into the Halloween spirit. <laughs> Nicole's in rare form today, y'all. This old thing used to make the blood run to my head. Make me dizzy. Oh, it's not that the fast. Just... Norma Creed! Oh, yeah. Kids. Witness name, Norma Creed. Sheriff Bannerman. Oh, has anyone made this park in Planet Coaster? Oh, my God, that'd be so good. Oh, please do. Yes. Oh, my God. Can we, can we do that? If that'd someone... be amazing. If someone actually does, like, please share. Or, I don't think I have, like, I, I, don't, I don't have Planet Coaster, but... That'd be awesome. So one of the um, one of the things I was told when I was a kid to scare me was like if I don't take a splinter out of my hand, like I need to get like if I got a splinter, yeah, I needed to get it taken out immediately, or else it would go into my bloodstream, into my heart, and kill me. <gasps> oh, like that's something that's, scary. I, that's something someone told me once. That's scary. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's little things like that. Like someone, I think so, there's like an artist that made a book or something like that with like little things that scare you like that. Like if you have a uh, a hangnail or whatever on the side, if you peel it and it goes like completely back on your on your thumb, yeah, stuff like that. Stuff that like probably doesn't actually happen, but or if you just put, the, just I know, or if you're mm. if you're ice skating and you fall and your hands stick out and someone runs over them, stuff like that. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, oh I don't like any of that. Mommy needs to see. Think you of can. orange hair. Your head looks like your hair. Does it? I used to have rose gold hair. So like it was like a pinky kind of hair color. It's just, it kind of sucks because it was a, uh, it, it came out really fast. 
the color. Okay, so the ballad of Ricky Bobby was on TV, and the grandma has the kids doing road cleanup because they keep trying to throw a toaster in her bath? Oh, no. Oh, God. Oh, so Taco said I started working on this in Planet Coaster once, but back then they didn't have half the rides I needed. Oh, darn. Well, Do they have the rides now? I was about to say, hopefully they've updated enough. Ooh. Yeah, I can totally see how the blood would go to your head on this ride. Whoa. <laughs> oh, that's great. <laughs> yep. I don't like this. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, it's a buggy man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, imagine this in VR. That'd be amazing. Uh. Uh. Wow, what a rush. What a rush. Oh man. You know, I'm still feeling it. Oh, that's better. Oh, too <laughs> It's just their heads now. There we go. <laughs> I like this ride better back when I was crushing Goliath zombies in it. Yep. Ah. <laughs> uh, where, where are you? So like, child. You know, doesn't want to mention anything Stop. about Boogeyman. Come. VR the heck out of it for next year's Halloween. That'd be awesome. Frustrated but affected the plan seemed incomplete. I know as well as anybody that the rules of the game can be changed with enough money. Blah blah blah. Sorry. I have a sinking feeling that I've been swinging that. Uh. Contact the organization will still be the plans. They're stonewalling it. Yeah, so I guess this is... Oh, what's, <laughs> what's the two long Crap, injury? what's this guy's name? Is it he from Swole? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. He's he's the owner of the park, right? Oh. I can't remember the guy's name, but this is from him. I'm Winters. Winters. That's yeah, right. right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. By the car. I was like, at first I was like, Gavin Winters, but nope, that's ah. a co-worker. <laughs> yeah. That's right. Yeah, that ride in VR would be amazing. Callum, where'd, where'd you go? go? Mm -hmm. Child. Mm -hmm. Come on, sweetie. Where am I supposed to go? Over here. Over here. Probably behind. Where? Yeah. Where have you entered anymore, in from? Callum. The other way. The other way. <laughs> Can't catch me. But I Why do kids have to be so creepy? Oh, I remember this. This was just last night. <laughs> <laughs> Look at those expressions. Yep. Treachery hides in thoughts. Treachery that lashes like a whip and scars our insides. The first time I saw Callum, my thoughts betrayed me. I looked down at this wrinkled red balling thing and I thought, is that it? Mm. We build our world from expectations and the world that I had built for Callum was no different. He was so real, so there, and so far from my expectations. I shattered, and as they fell in pieces, that one treacherous thought became a new foundation. All of the love that we shared, all of the warmth and goodness that followed, built on a single traitorous thought. Oh. Oh, hello. What was that? Oh, God. I thought working on the park for a summer would be a lot of fun, but at the end, but the end of the season here really drags. There aren't many tourists around, and most of the staff spend their days standing around gossiping. I mean, that's literally every amusement park. I feel like that's every amusement park. That's yeah. every uh, restaurant, every retail store. Yeah, they're just like, yeah, get out of here. <laughs> I mean, Steve, see? Even I'm starting to call him Chad, and I went to school with the guy. Oh. That goddamn suit. The beginning was a laugh. Steve, the local lush, as Chad the chipmunk. Child-friendly mascot at Atlantic Island Park. Lock up your daughters and all that. But the more he wears that suit, the weirder Steve is getting. At first, those little things, like refusing, refusing to change out of his suit at work and taking it home with him every day. Closet furry. That's okay. <laughs> Saw that Susie Steiner still wearing it. Wasn't even a work day. Some of the staff complained discreetly to park management about the smell. And Ugh. I saw him, ugh. ugh. I'll go around with Mr. Winter, the owner, one day. And uh -huh. it seemed to have changed. Suit still smells like a carcass. Ugh. Yeah. 
Apparently Steven is Take him outside, dab him down skills. with the hose. Puking in the gutter outside the sick whale station. Ugh. Because he can sure as hell carve a mean ice sculpture. And the shapes he makes in the ice, though, they give me creeps. Steve came by the booth, looking <laughs> me. Hung around for a while. When, this game uh, has been changed forever. Well, when oh, you said God. that we would finally find out that truth behind chat, I didn't expect Closet Furry. The game has been changed forever. <laughs> Call my supervisor. I'm skipping over a couple parts. Uh, supervisor told me to put everything in writing. So here it is. Also, I quit. <laughs> oh! Oh! That wasn't Chad. That wasn't Chad. Was that Laura, the person who wrote it? I like how she's just like. <sighs> I remember. Okay, I remember on. that one. Yeah. Bye. Yep. We're done. Like, uh, yeah. She doesn't want to say anything about it. She's just like, cool. All right. All right. No problem. Yep. I mean, wouldn't you do the same? No. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? Or who? Who was, was that? that? She's seen <laughs> worse. Yeah. I mean, working in and a place so like this, I. I imagine. I um. One of my first jobs. Sorry? Uh, one of my first jobs was um, working at Carowinds, which is a oh. park here in North Carolina. And doesn't yeah. that turn into Scarowinds? Yeah, it does. I didn't work Scarowinds, though. So I worked at a amusement park. <laughs> Isn't that how Secret World starts? It's, it's not necessarily. I know, I'm just kidding. It's There's how no like bees around. it's how like the Illuminati kind of thing sort of starts, right? Like, yeah, you're not getting shocked, but you're on like a doctor's table. Oh, nice getting that achievement, bro. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> hi, spooky oh, friends. Hi, hey, Bomber. You should do a speed run of this. Uh, I wonder what a speedrun of this would yeah, actually yeah, yeah. end up. What is the world record for the park, I wonder? Um, <laughs> I'm going to Google it. Whoa. The shakes. Oh, cool. There's a leaderboard at speedrun.com. Is there actually one? Yeah. So I'm, uh, the rank number one finished it in 17 minutes and 50 seconds. Wow. Guy named Drewski five months ago beat it in 17 minutes, 50 seconds. Wow. Hmm. Oh, that's so cool. You can watch the videos. I wonder if people have found any ways to, like, get around. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa! No. Bamboozled. I actually remember the first time I had that, I saw that, and I actually was legitimately kind of scared. That jump scare actually got me too the first time I remember. Did it? It's just like I knew I knew it was gonna be coming, so I, I guess I could have act surprised, but I'm not. Yeah. I'm not much of a much. Mu I'm not much for acting like that. It's got to be an organic. <laughs> I wish I was that good at driving. <laughs> That's pretty good. What is that pop up blur on the screen? It's a matter of public record that I am a failure. A pop up blur on. Oh oh oh. Once the heartbeat like your. Oh yeah, it's I just her heartbeat. In the car while I ran an errand. Don't even remember what it was. When I came back, the sheriff was standing next to the car, watching my boy through the window. I didn't like what I saw in his eyes. I Judgment. mean, yeah, the car was off. He wrote me the ticket without saying a word. Just the scratch, scratch of his pen on the notepad. When he gave it to me, our eyes met. I know what you're going through. My daughter, Helen, she... Just get some help. Help was a bolt of lightning. Help was a thousand volts surging through my veins. Help is agony. I'd rather die. I wanted to scream. I'd rather you pulled your gun and shot me. But instead my mouth said, yes, Sheriff. So like, it's interesting, the deeper you get into the park, the more her, her thoughts kind of come out. What? Hold on one sec. Oh, allow. <laughs> Sorry. Um. Oh. oh, I was like, hi, Chad. What are you doing here? Mm -hmm. Oh, you know, just creeping. Just creeping around, puking inside of gutters, you know. Like the stairs from the other side? Oh, no, they're here. Ignore me. 
Eh. Mommy is coming, Kelm. Ooh. Oh yeah, so the the effect that you're seeing the pop up around the screen. Oh. Whee! I don't like that. Was um yeah, it's like it's like to simulate your character being like really scared and like you know when you're having you ever have like, a panic attack and your your eyesight just kind of gets I don't know that I've ever had that. Well, oh, to really? be fair, I'm lucky. I've never had a panic attack oh, before. Oh, wow. <laughs> you can only be so lucky. I know. <laughs> your boy has been through them, so... Yeah, you, your view gets like a little bit tunnel visioned, and it, huh. it's actually a little bit more... It's more accurate than you might think. But huh, I definitely, I definitely get a little like tunnel vision, and sometimes I can see like the sides of my vision kind of like pulsating. Oh, my. Oh, well, it's, that sounds it's not great. It's not no, great. No, I, I, I assume that also enhances the anxiety. Oh no, yeah, for sure. And it's like my brain likes to like process whatever it's put in front of. Yeah. So when things are kind of going a little bit awry, then its brain goes into like, oh, there shouldn't be happening mode, and it just like, oh god, spirals uh, out. Yeah. No, that's not scary. Yeah, it sucks. Um. But that's that's when like when you're really scared in a in a major like fight or flight. Yeah. Moment. But your the anxiety comes on from like sometimes just no reason, right? It sometimes. can. It can, and that's yeah, that's. Therein lies the issue, right? Like, that's when, you know, that can be, like, a disorder or something like that. When you right. have, you know, anxiety for no reason or, like, you have a panic attack for no, no like, w without actually having a... People come into your life yeah, for a, a reason. Moment. Yeah. So it happens. Dad used to say that before Mom. <clears throat> After that, he mostly just drank. Things were different for Don and I. When we met, I was sweeping the floor at Susie's diner. Susie's diner. Susie's With Pam the Clam. But he didn't... Try to flirt and cop a feel like the others. Mm, group hug. I just ordered a coffee and sat there, watching me. When my shift was over, he offered to walk me home. Aww. I don't know how to describe Taka that. Taka says, "Yeah, I think this deserves a group hug." We talked and laughed and group hug. eventually kissed. It felt like love. It felt like a fairy tale. I can't tell you if Calum was made that night or one of the ones that followed. Oh my. Mm. I think it has to be that night. That one perfect night. Don and I moved in together, but then, well, he died. Is there anything around you? According to the supervisor, no his safety harness failed no. when he was okay. working on the top of the Ferris wheel. Don was there one moment, and then gone. Sometimes people leave your life for no reason. I was three months pregnant with Callum. Fairy tale fucking over. Oh my. Mm -hmm. There's no, no reason for that language. <laughs> this is a dark game. No, I know. I always wonder, like, uh, if there's been streamers who have played this with, like, friends for, like, jump reactions and stuff like mm -hmm. that, and they get to these parts with, like, the dark stuff, and it's just kind of like, oh, but it feels bad, man. Yeah. Oh, that's funny, Taco. Yeah, because of the accent. Dawn sounds... Ugh. Dawn? <laughs> dawn sounds like... Like saying Dawn. See, I got it, too. What? Dawn. Dawn. Oh, I see. Oh, oh, Dawn. I get it. Yeah, okay, so got like it, saying got it, Dawn. Got it. Dawn. Yeah. Because, like, yeah. Northeasterners add that extra W. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's so, a good point. Yeah, so I, I even say it a little bit. Like, when I say Dawn, you'll hear. Dawn. You, you might hear Dawn, like the sun rising, or like a or feminine ay, name. Ay. Instead of Dawn, short for Donald. I'm coffee with Dawn. <clears throat> Aww. Jimmy says, my wife watched a group of people stream this game, and they are in no way prepared for the ending because they are not ready reading stuff seriously. Yeah, well, I'm, I was, I'm, I've been thinking about what we were talking about, too, Jimmy, in Discord. Like, so so I, I did a podcast recently with a Zero Point Report uh, talking about Moons of Madness, and at, in, in, like, the green room afterward, like, in our little lounge, we were talking about the park and how, like, kind of dark it gets and, like, the... Kind of? It gets really dark, right? And then... Sorry, one sec. <clears throat> it gets really dark, and then, like, it's kind of like two games in one, almost, because there's, like, the exploration element, and then there's the second half. But then, like, when you get to the ending, you realize, like, it kind of puts the whole game into a different perspective. And, like, I don't know, playing through it again after you know that's the true. ending... That's true. No, that's a good point. ...kind of gives it a totally different yeah, yeah, yeah. What am I supposed to do here? Um, ride thought, the Ferris wheel again. I thought that was supposed to be a thing where, like, the thing drops down and breaks open the... Passageway. I don't Did I miss remember. something? <clears throat> yeah, the people. Yeah, people who were like, "Oh, this is just a fun, ha ha game." Oh, ticket, ticket in the thing near the log. Oh, 
Thanks. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm not much help because I haven't played it in quite a while either. No, it's all good. Um, it's what we have chat for. Yeah. Especially, especially OGers like Taco. I was like, whenever you see the um, there Whoa. it is. Whoa. Um, whenever you see the loading on the screen, it's like, all right, so shit's about to happen. Yeah. So this effect here, yeah, yeah like yeah. this is this is something that I've I've had, not quite as severely. Like this is for dramatic effect or whatever. But I have I have had times where like, when my heart's racing, the my my peripheral vision gets huh. a little bit blurred. Whoa. And I can I I, get a little bit of tunnel vision. Yeah. Yeah. Interesting. Huh. I'd love to see the part two where you play as Callum, which would be hmm. its own version yeah, of messed up. It would be. That would be amazing. Make me vomit. That would be. You give up nine months of your life carrying them, you traumatize yourself giving birth to them, and then you spend the rest of your life as their slave. Wiping asses, mopping a piss, feeding them, little life-sucking monsters who take and take and take until... <sighs> we all go insane. Any parent who pretends otherwise is just dishonest. That's called choice supportive bias. I am honest. Callum really she just needs a vacation. My gears, and he <laughs> owes me everything. Everything. It served the little fuck right if I just abandoned him. Huh. I always wonder, like, if there are, like, legitimate people. I, I know they're out there that, like, you know, you give birth and you, you don't get that spark that you were hoping for. They're like, the, oh my god, I want to hug and protect this thing and, like, give my life to it. Where other people are like... Yeah. Some people are, yeah, some people do and some people don't. And, uh, yeah, I definitely read that some people who don't get that at the very beginning, they're just like, this is just a baby, like, get that feeling of, like, protectiveness and, like, you know, like, need for a kid later on when they bind and, like, get, you know, like, what not bind. Want? When you, uh, to talk bond, is what I mean to say. What do you mean? What have you done to him? Yeah, the so Taco. Yeah, I was gonna say like, oh, it sounds you like it sounds like Lorraine needs therapy, but it, it clearly like using language like choice to put a bias like suggests yeah that she has already been through therapy and has had a psychiatrist or had had has had presumably or inferred by the cutscenes electroshock therapy and some sort some form of physical therapy like that and didn't react to it well. Which has mm -hmm. oh hi. Has both of you. <laughs> no happy ending here, I'm afraid. Just, just leave me alone. Fool, you always were. You fool. You fool. You always know they're bad. Emotional roller coaster. Uh, uh. <laughs> my life. <laughs> oh, this is the longest roller coaster ever. You can taste your dreams. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. god. <coughs> uh, Joel did an amazing interview about the park and the research behind mental states post birth. I don't think I I watched that, but I want to now. I mean, I know I know very little about childcare myself, but I have right. an immense amount of respect for moms out there who do manage to keep it together. Bro. Well. Uh, While keeping it together. Taka says, yeah, my sister, for example, had a pretty bad case of postpartum initially. But now I don't know a lot of mothers. But I don't know a lot of mothers who are that loving and supportive. Hmm. And I know I was a problem child myself. Were you? So, mm, so I have a lot of, a lot of respect to my mom for putting up with my, <laughs> my nonsense. It works. The calculations and adjustments worked. The transport and storage mechanisms seem to be flawless. What a wonderful day. When... If only these people knew what they were feeling. Yes. Um. Uh. Comment on YouTube. Uh. This game is good. 
Uh, see what the new one is like. One request from Com. Please, please, please add in controller support for Secret World Legends. Um, hmm? They're, they're asking if it was a YouTube comment. Controller support for Secret World Legends. Uh, no official support is planned right now, although you can already map. Like, I've used... Like, you can use third-party, like, apps and stuff like that. Like, we don't necessarily, like, officially condone it. We can't give official support for it, but it is possible. <laughs> Jimmy does some pretty cool controller stuff. Yeah, I was going to say, Jimmy does <laughs> Jimmy does some really good controller stuff. Uh, he, he was the one who actually, like, helped me uh, figure out some stuff for controller support when I was doing, like, trying to do, like, camera work in the mm -hmm. game to get, like, a steady camera and all that. Yeah. So. And also banana support. And banana support, the yes. The um... But uh, what was I going to say? Yeah, we don't officially support controllers for Secret World Legends. I have profiles uh, on my website and public this Steam controller profile. Challenge. Oh. This isn't a game. Are you not amused? But she's clearly, like, worried for him. Callum has bruises on his arms, finger marks. Someone has been hurting him. Who could have that been? I've asked him, demanded really, to know where he got the marks. But he doesn't want to answer me. Something has scared him into silence. He doesn't dare talk. He's been changing too. Something sinister lurks in the darkness behind his eyes. I catch him staring at me at odd moments. In the night, he tosses and turns and cries out words that I cannot understand. When I try to soothe him, he snaps and bites at my fingers. I think he wants to talk to me. I think he wants to tell me. They are watching him every minute of every day. They are whispering to him in his sleep, changing him. They are taking my baby away from me. I can save him. There will be pain. But I love him, and in the end, he will understand why. I don't understand a lot of it, because, like, to be fair, I haven't, like... I don't know much about mental illnesses and, and things like that. Mm, yeah. So it's kind of like... On one hand, she's like, I love him, I'm worried for him. Oops. Sorry. Oh, you're fine. Found out who did it. But, like, on the other, she's, like, clearly abusing him. Like, and saying, like, oh, who hurt you? And Probably, like yeah. I mean, like, it's, it's heavily, heavily inferred. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can, or rather, yeah, you can infer from... But then she's just like, oh, who did this? And, like, I don't know. It's... It's heavy. It's, very confusing. It's, it's really heavy stuff. I know it yeah. goes very deep. It's probably not something you could really explain. It's hard for me, especially you know, especially it's not someone who's like as close to the development process as like Joel, for example. Right. Like I'm, uh, I can't give like the kind of insight that Joel might be able to, for example. Um, yeah, that's true. That's true. I'd love to be. Able, yeah, I should probably look up the interview in a little bit because I'm probably gonna do like a. Well, this is this is just me kind of like rambling. Yeah, and, like, just kind of like expressing my thoughts on sure. it because like. I'm very lucky that I don't have any sort of like, like, I don't have anxiety. I don't have like any kind of illnesses myself. Yeah, you're one of the lucky ones. I am. I'm super, <laughs> super lucky. Uh, so like putting myself in shoes of others who do have those kind of things is really hard for me. Um, I can understand the best I can by trying to listen, but. Yeah, even though you can't necessarily like, you haven't had those experiences, you know, I mean. You, ex you still exercise with compassion, which is good. I try. <laughs> yeah, yeah, which is great, which is great, because that's, you know, that's, sometimes that's what someone needs, oh, you know. Bastard. But yeah, like, uh, like Taco was saying also, like, so the voice acting, the, the delivery of the lines and the lines themselves are all, like, I think really well done in mm -hmm. this. Uh, yeah, they're, yeah. They're, it's all about a lot of, like, really powerful material. Um certainly drives discussion and yeah, discourse no about you know just what's what's going on what's happening discussions about oh god <laughs> i actually got scared by that oh, i god. only remember that because there was a great clip on of someone else on twitch that was just recent that someone was scared by that oh oh andy I was surprised. I yeah, was surprised. Yeah, yeah. I got surprised. It would be. By that. It would need too if I didn't expect it. It's Oof, like I totally forgot yeah. about that. No, it's one of the. Damn it, yeah. Chad. <laughs> Lol. Um, God damn it. Errol says I highly recommend Hellblade if you want to explore mental illness in the form of a game. Uh, I'll I'll take a look. Yes, Hellblade. Was it called Hellblade? Yeah. It was, yeah. Uh, wasn't there a subtitle to it too? But it's about it's about a character who's like kind of like clawing her way out of like like essentially, her fight literally fighting her demons. Oh, I okay. think, I think I want to say interesting. 
Okay. Yeah. Oh, uh, oh, uh, Waffle and Crack. Did Anakin Online ever get that graphical update? The uh, new engine beta is live right now. It's not like fully finished yet, but you can you can play with like updated graphics now if you want. You can get it off the website. Um, you can get it off the your the account page. I believe it's just like the new engine client or something like that. Pills here. Pills here. Pills here. Pills. 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 These are mine. Hmm. Curious. What's that say? Curious what the... I was the... trying to read her tattoo. Oh, I was trying to read the prescription on the bottle. <laughs> Fuck gravity. Who needs it, right? Say no to gravity. Dude, no, that says graffiti, but there was another one that said gravity. Yeah. Fuck gravity. <laughs> His what? His daughter is hot. Well, yeah, but what did it say above that? His is a father. I, I don't know. Whatever. Oh, something is a fat pig, but his daughter's hot now. If you're the bogeyman, stop Bogey. picking your nose then. That's the Bannerman thing. That's right. It's, yeah, they mentioned that earlier. Whoa. Yeah, that's right. It was the sheriff. Mm-hmm. Don't leave me here, Cal. Ooh. Knock it down. Just tripping her nuts off. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> well, we're in those pills. <laughs> I'll have what she's having. Yeah, right. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a heroic dose of acid in every single pill, apparently. Yeah. Oh my god. Don't, don't take pills you find in a random carnival show. Shay. Ch <laughs> yeah. That's really good advice. <laughs> or buckle up. <laughs> yeah, strap in. <laughs> oh, Tango and Cash. We don't believe that the earth belongs to the battered goats and the shamrock afterbirth. Mm. Oh god. <laughs> Sweet. The temptress who grips the shaft, twists the shaft, absconding with the third age into the fourth age. The third age. Oh, rescue of Tango and Tech Cash! Yeah! While well, gods lie writhing on the shattered face of the earth. Wow, this is a. Oh, this is a little short story, got it. Yeah. Interesting. Gale has sweetness and grace, but her days are numbered. Heavy-fisted hives break before frozen w frozen wills and... Huh? Calligraphic actresses and pencil and paper pornography. The all-seeing eye will provide decade-long updates on this story going forward. Ooh. Oh my. Yeah, this is a ton of uh, references to Secret Worlds, Solomon hmm. Island storyline. Yeah, we're talking about the third age and fourth age, uh, Beaumont coming through, all that jazz. Um... Gosh. I'm probably going to use this as a stopping point oh. soon. I'm getting into this. Yeah. I know. But we can... Oh. My hands! Oh, ouch. I see. Never ouch. 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 Oh, I don't like this. This is uncomfortable. Oh. She's turning into a tiger. Oh, I don't like this. I forgot about that. That's uncomfortable. What a strange trip it's been, yep. <laughs> strange trip, yeah. Mm hmm Wow. Well, what's the, what's the album title? Like, what a long, strange trip it's been or something like that? <laughs> awkward stopping point. <laughs> awkward stopping point. Yeah, this is an awkward stopping point. So on that... <laughs> on that, on that note, bombshell. Yeah, yeah. Millions of people die every year in car crashes. And the park has little cars designed specifically to simulate that action. Hear the children scream with joy. In the sideshow alley, you can walk away with 15 cents worth of mass-produced Chinese teddy bears while a grinning carny pockets your hard-earned five dollars. And what secrets lie beneath the sullen waters of the lake? The tears of jilted lovers, the soiled condoms of illicit affairs, the clotted blood of the lonely suicide. She's got away with words. And the face of the witch looms over it all. I always despised a toothy grin and warty nose. I hate that sparkle in her weathered, watchful eyes. I think Callum is waiting for me. Inside. Oh. I mean, we could finish it out, I guess. Uh, or we could... We could always leave it for next leave Wednesday? Leave it for another stream, yeah. We could do next Wednesday. Yeah, we could do that next... We could finish out the park next Wednesday. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, okay. I'm okay with that. Yeah. Well, that was quite the... Quite the roller coaster ride. 
Um, no, it's a fun game. Yeah, it is. Yes, but I think I think what we're gonna do is pause it right there. Um, God, that was heavy. I forgot how heavy this game yeah, is. Yeah, yeah. Pun was it touches intended. on a lot of stuff. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it really makes you think. Yeah, yeah we're especially... gonna park it right here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah I got it. <laughs> yeah. Was that spe- intended? Of course it was. Oh, okay. What a roller coaster. Of course it's intended. Um, all all puns are intended. <laughs> Um, oh, too bad. It's next Wednesday isn't a moon. Oh, we're going to the moon now. Moon's a madness stream. Oh, that's right. Next Wednesday. We can play moons next week. Or, well, we'll probably end up playing moons on launch day anyway. But yeah. we'll see. No promises, but we'll see exactly. Well, how we'll that probably goes. play the park sometime next week. If not next we'll, week, the we'll, week after. <laughs> we'll, finish it, we'll finish it for Halloween, or we'll just. Yeah. <laughs> or we'll just decide. Or we can, we can do it another time. Yeah. Who knows? We'll see. Who knows? We'll get back to you guys. Um. Yeah. So, man, that was really heavy. Now I'm like, oh. So anyway, uh, more housekeeping stuff. Just again, reminders. So the park is coming out on the Nintendo Switch on October 22nd. Yep. Uh, same day. So that's next Tuesday, which is the same day as Moons of Madness coming out on PC on Steam. Mm-hmm. Um. We will be playing. What is it? Mutant Year Zero tomorrow? tomorrow yeah. Yes. Mutant Year Zero tomorrow. And then Friday is going to be... More Hide and Shriek. More Hide and Shriek. Yes. Excellent. Yeah. And then don't forget about our contest that we have going on. Uh, Code Next House is the emote contest. And then for all the games, we have a screenshot contest. So send in a screenshot. Your spookiest screenshot for how, for uh, Secret World, Anarchy Online, Age of Conan, and or um, Code Next House. Did I already say that? Yeah. So those four games, and then you could win a signed poster for whatever game you enter in and win. Um, and then don't don't also forget for Secret World Legends yeah. the agent writing contest. Yes. Uh, where you essentially it's essentially where you create your own like almost like fan fiction, but then we can make it canon. Yeah. If you win, yeah. so the the grand prize winner will get an agent, uh, their agent description um, adapted to the game with a custom drawn portrait of their agent character and then uh, runner-ups will get their uh, agent text adapted to the game with uh with a different kind of agent portrait uh not necessarily like a custom hand-drawn one but maybe like put together yeah kind of similar to the other agents that you might see in a booster pack Uh, but that's going to be really exciting uh entries are due for both of those contests by the 31st which is halloween um that should cover everything that i can think of do you have anything else okay contests Great. We'll be here tomorrow. Great. So, yeah, tune in tomorrow. Ooh, sorry. <clears throat> tune in tomorrow at 11 a.m. Eastern for Mutant New Zero. Until then. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Bye. See you guys. Thanks for tuning in. <laughs> I love that this thing has oh a tail. God. It makes me so happy. <laughs> All right. We'll see you. Bye. Bye-bye.